Howard Schultz is a businessman and philanthropist, best known for his tenure as CEO of Starbucks, but before he became a household name, Schultz had a humble beginning. Born in Brooklyn, New York in July 19, 1953, Schultz grew up in the Canarsie neighborhood, the son of a truck driver and a stay-at-home mother. He attended Northern Michigan University on a football scholarship, where he earned a bachelor's degree in communications. After college, Schultz worked in sales for Xerox and then for a Swedish company called Hammerplast, which sold coffee-making equipment. It was during this time that he first discovered his passion for coffee. In 1981, Schultz joined Starbucks as the director of retail operations and marketing. At that time, Starbucks was a small chain of coffee shops primarily focused on selling coffee beans, but Schultz saw the potential for the company to become a cultural icon and a lifestyle brand. In 1985, Schultz left Starbucks to start his own coffee company, Illinois Journal, but in 1987, he was able to buy the rights to the Starbucks name and merge his company with the original Starbucks. Under Schultz's leadership, Starbucks expanded rapidly, opening thousands of stores worldwide and becoming one of the most recognized and successful brands in the world. Schultz stepped down as CEO in 2000 but returned to the company in 2008. During a difficult period for the company, he helped to turn the company around and once again made it a profitable and successful business. In 2018, Schultz stepped down again as the executive chairman of Starbucks. Howard Schultz's story is one of determination, vision, and the American dream. He took a small Seattle coffee company and turned it into a global phenomenon. His leadership and business acumen have not only made him a successful entrepreneur but also a role model for many people. Thanks for watching, and stay tuned for more about the history makers.